to adapt to a new idea. So that's why there was regular sugar. That's when the Imam kept in contact with these four people. And afterwards, when people had adapted to the idea of looking at somebody else that is not a Muslim and looking at these ulama, the Imam then declared that he will not be meeting these certain people or anybody else for that matter in person. And the Ummah was to look at the ulama for their problems. Um, after that, the Zayda Sugra started. And um, the Imam declared that whoever is to come Whoever comes and declares that he is in direct contact with the Imam is a liar. Um, now, when we look at the need, uh, we need somebody learned to guide us. Uh, we need a specialist in everything. And for example, we won't take our car to the doctor to get it to get our car fixed, right? Uh, just in terms of that, a normal person like us who does not have all the knowledge about religion can't make fatwas and can't determine that okay, you know what? This is what I'm going to do. This is what's right and this is what's wrong. Um, that's why we need. That's why we need. We need guidance of a masoom. But these, but these masooms, they don't come and talk to us directly because what we, because of basically what we've done, um, the public is not ready for Imam Ali Salam his zahur. And uh, if he was to come at a time like this, we would just let him die, just like it happened with the rest of the imams. Um, and if we don't have the plea, what will happen is that every person will have their own, inter own interpretation of the religion and you know, we'll be, just like any other religion, we'll be so far away from the truth that um, it'll just be hard to get back on track. If you really look at it, the Imams, uh, the 9th, 10th and 11th Imams actually established the plate before, um, before the day of the 12th Imam and that was just to get people ready for, um, you know, just to get them used to the idea. Um, how the fleet works, basically there comes a time in everyone's life where you're obliged to follow a marja. Um, there are many marja to fleet out there, uh, but one's responsibility is to try to try to pick and choose who is the most learned or alam marja. Um, and in terms of that, they must follow this marja in every aspect. Uh, because this marja will be determining what, how we'll be doing um, and how we'll be, you know, going by our daily lives. Uh, that's why we need to pick who we, who we think is the most knowledgeable. Um, if we were to pick somebody else, then you know, it won't, it won't be the same thing. Um, the marja, the requirements of the marja, that the marja must be male. He must be ismashi, sane. He must be adult. Uh, of legitimate birth and living. Uh, there's also another method of, um, if you don't want to follow Marja, you have to also get, um, the other method is that you yourself become a Muslim. But that is a very hard level to get to. And um, in terms of when you look at that, we, we can follow Marja and it makes life easier for us because we don't have to go out and do all the research and everything ourselves for years and years and years. And we have somebody that's already there for our benefit to you know, take advantage of. Um, uh, the way you can determine if somebody is a Marja or not, um, it's either by being at a Muslim level yourself, which I just explained is very hard. Um, there's also a few other ways when two just people, idle people, we're learning to have to, have to, need to identify a Muslim, um, deem that this person is alam and he is a murder, provided that two other alam people do not contradict him. Um, also, one acts on the verdicts of the murder when they hear from the Muslim himself, when the verdict is quoted by two alam people, um, when a man hears the verdict from a person whose statement satisfies him, so basically if you think that person, again, is if I know somebody and I think that he knows what he's talking about and he's in contact with the marja and he knows about his fatwas, then I should look into what he's saying. Um, also, you can read you can read the books of the marja, which are called the Kauzi um, al-Masaj. But, but the condition is that it should be correct and you must have the correct sources. Um,